Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at an awesome couples coach that is perfect for state and national parks and it still gives you a ton of luxury, quality, and amenities. This is a 2022 Newmore Bay Star model 3014. We are gonna take a look at some of the outside features first and the inside features then we're gonna give you three things we love about the Bay Star and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. I am super excited to be taking a look at this luxurious quality State National Park Class A, the Bay Star. But before I begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey, Andrea! Hey, everyone! How's it going today? It's going good. I'm so glad to be home here in Tampa. Yes! And you guys, this is a beautiful coach. Yes! I cannot wait for you to see it, so hold on to your seat. Here we go now. Andrea, let's begin. Model is Newmar Bay Star 3014. The actual tip, tip length of this motorhome is 30 feet 11 inches. This is perfect for state and national parks because people are going to call this a 30 footer. Full body paint comes standard. I love the headlight design and everything. Nice big windshield, everything right there. What's very unique and awesome about this motorhome is these tires. First and foremost, look at these tires. Yeah, they're the Michelins. 235-80R22.5. You love those. I love those <laughs> with these shiny alcohol rims. The reason why I love these even more is because so many times when you're looking at a 30-foot motorhome, you can only get those 19.5s. This one, they're able to give you those bigger tires on this unit. Super, super nice. Over here, Andrea, it does have the new 7.3 liter V8. It is the Godzilla engine. 350 horsepower and 468 pound-feet of torque. And then over here, Andrea, check out these mirrors. Black mirrors to match the full body paint. Looks beautiful. Right here's a flag holder. So you can rep your country, rep your state, rep your sports team with a flag right there at your motorhome. Awesome. Very there's nice. Camera. And cameras right there, left side, right side. There's also a camera in reverse. Coming on down the side here, we do have frameless windows throughout the whole motorhome. When we open the door, um, you got the little door latch there. We'll talk about that a little bit later. And we do have a very nice Good power size. with LED lights. And then check out this storage. Not a ton of storage going on there. But I do like the sideways swinging doors. I did notice. Oh. Over here? What's that? We got the carpet here, huh? Oh, yeah, a little bit of carpet action going on. Okay. Down the side there, Andrea. You can see that it does have the instant hot tankless water heater from Truma. That's nice. It is. And then coming on down the side here, look at this slide out. Again, on a more price point Class A gas motorhome, the fact that they're giving you flush slide outs is very, very nice. Right here, we do got the Cummins Onan 5500 gasoline generator. Very nice. Ooh. And then right here, look at that, more storage. Okay. Sweet. Very nice. Coming around the back, we do have a fiberglass rear cap. Makes it really nice, nice high end looking. 5,000 pound hitch, this motorhome can tow 5,000 pounds. You do have your backup camera there. Also, there is a ladder to get up on the one piece fiberglass roof. Andrea, let's go up there and take a look. All right, Matt, here hold on, now. take your time. Here we go. Up here on the roof, this actually does not appear to be a fiberglass roof. I think it's like a, a, like a cross flex roof. Let me know down in the comments below if you know. Right there we got not one, but two air conditioning units. I love that. It is prepped for solar right up here. You do have a little Zamp solar panel there, more solar. And then right there, you can see that there is your digital antenna. Hey Matt, take your time. Here we go. Slow. I'm slow. Okay. All right, hold on. Two steps. Great, and if you haven't already, make sure y'all smash that thumbs up button. What are the RV salesmen taking this fat ass up on the roof? Showing you what features the roof has to offer. Nobody. Nobody. I'm just shocked actually to see a ladder. Yes. Right over here, 50 amp power cord. 
Auto okay. transfer switch right there, very nice. Right over here, here's where you fill up your fuel. Oh, you know what that's for? For your stinky slinky. Yes, ma'am, storage for the stinky slinky. And what's we got here? Oh, that is locked. More storage. Yes. Or it's the wet bay. We'll find out in a second. Here's oh, the wet bay. Oh, that's, that's simple, I like that. Yes, fresh water connection, outdoor shower, uh, tank heaters, water purifier system, everything. And then here, yeah, look at that. Not a lot of storage on this No, one. no, there, there's a dump station, a little bit of storage. Here's your battery bank. interstate batteries. It looks like it's on a tray too. And then it's gonna be propane. Yeah, not a lot of storage on this side. There's your propane tanks in here. Bing, there's all the specifications about this motorhome as well. Well, Andrea, the outside of the base car looks great, but the inside looks even better. Let's go take a look. Wow, I'm glad you're skipping today. Even though we're at the dealership and there's people here. Yes, ma'am. We need the cargo carrying capacity, Matt, and I will get that since I'm right here. It is, no way, 1,224? Okay. Wow. Okay, guys. It's a little guys. bit low because it is on that lighter weight chassis. All right. Coming Check it out. in. I'm gonna do a spin oh, here, excuse sorry. me. Sorry. All right, and we've got the slide in everybody, as you can see. Look at this. And yes. you still have plenty of walkway. I mean, I'm having no problem at all. You can get through here. Um, here is the bathroom. Yes. It looks like you can still open the refrigerator here. And the master bedroom, which you can still use the bed with the slide in. I love it. And Andrea, while we get the slide outs out, let's take a quick moment to thank the sponsor, RV Life, for this episode. Matt's RV Reviews is proudly sponsored by RV Life, tools that make camping simple. Everybody knows when it comes to camping, it can be a little stressful, but not with RV Life. So first, discover, research campgrounds and other locations of interest with detailed information, but for RVers. Plan your trip accordingly with the popular Trip Planner. That software is amazing. It's gonna tell you the best routes and you can go with your RV safe GPS. Not only are you typing in your specifications so it knows not to take you under any low bridges, but you can actually use that offline. So so if you're at a place with no Wi-Fi, you'll still have your GPS and you can share it with their RV community, guys. RV Life is more than just an app. It's an awesome program that all RVers should have. What we're doing is a free seven day trial for Matt's RV Reviews customers and 25% off on top of that. So all you do is go to their website, rvlife.com, sign up for the free seven day trial by clicking our link down below or typing in Matt's RV Reviews. Don't download the app because you, then you won't get the free seven days. So do it on the website, register Matt's RV Reviews, then download the app. We appreciate RV Life for sponsoring this video and sponsoring Matt's RV Reviews. Let's continue the video. Great, Andre, now that you can see what it looks like with the slide outs open, this motor home is beautiful. Let's get started with the cockpit area. So up front here, very nice 7.3 liter V8. Got your auto leveling right here, cup holders, battery boost. Here's all the controllers. I got plenty of space at my feet. It's a nice place for you to set your cell phone down. And then we got our cameras right there. Andrea, sit in my co-captain seat. Got yes. your cup holders there. 7.3 liter, very nice steering wheel, cruise control. There's all your buttons and everything. Andrea, how does it feel right there? It's very comfortable. Yes. Lots of leg room. There sure is. Um, both these seats do swivel. And what is this? It's like a little computer tray. Oh. Very I like nice. That. Yes, ma'am. That's very nice. I have an electrical outlet over here, a USB. Yes. I do have a privacy shades right here. Oh, okay. Very and nice. Look at this. Nice storage. Yeah. Up here. No bunk over the cab. Okay. Very I'm, nice. I'm liking the color of the cabinets. And there's speakers underneath. Very nice. And then here's your base star support. This is, um, uh, who is this? What's their name? New, where? It doesn't say their name. Normally it says the person's name. Oh, no more. Kaylee? Oh, there it is. Kaylee. Yeah, thanks, Kaylee, for all the support before, during, and after every sale. 
These are nice chairs and they do swivel around to become part of the living area. And Matt, there is a cupboard up there or storage. Can you No, up? this is all like all oh, your control panels. Oh, good. Your awning, your slide outs, your your inverter and everything. Very, Very nice. nice. Yes, ma'am. And then over here, look at the slide out. I love look that. Look at the lights there. How do you like that? I like it. Very nice cabinetry. Look at this. This is beautiful. It is. And by opening it, you can tell that it's good quality. Okay, we're sitting down here, and um, there is, oh, snap, y'all. We got daytime oh, wow. shades and privacy shades. Very nice. And then check out these balances. Andrea? Approved! Andrea approved <laughs> balances. How can I not? They're adorable. And then check out the sofa. These cushions are kind of like seater. Well, not just a three seater cushion, but like three. Oh, you see, good you back see what's going on. Yeah, like good um center. For your back lumbar. Support. Yeah, lumbar, yeah. So let's exactly. see if that does anything, Matt. I wonder. Oh, is it is it no, it's a pull out. Oh no, it's a pull out. Good. Yeah, it will come all the way out. And then right there we got some storage. Okay. And then we got power right there, accent lights Very and everything. Nice. And then kind of adjacent to it. This is where the TV is. It's nice that it is on like a little angle right there. Look at this. We got tons of storage above there. Look at this. Very beautiful and nice. So this is where they're making up, I guess. Yeah. the outside. I like that there's a nice big window here. Yes, big window. And uh, really, really nice. These bottom parts do open. Solid surface countertop it, on this that's, table that's here. That's surprising. Look at this. I love this dinette with the cushions over there, Matt. Look. Yes. And yes, yes, yes. Do we have storage under here? Uh -huh. Okay, good. Very nice. You got storage under the dinette. Yes, and this does drop down. I guess you can make a little bed out of it. You sure can. And then let's see if it's comfortable. Very comfortable. And look at this. We missed Very. the sound bar, but look, you guys, there's some drawers here. Nice. So you got some more storage. Yes, ma'am. And then a cabinet under here. This thing might not have a lot of storage on the outside, but it sure does. It, it sure is kicking butt on storage on the inside. And then, Andrea, would you like to show us the kitchen? Yes, but before I do, I just want to remind everybody that we are now part of RVR, which is a nationwide network of dealerships. Currently, we have over 104, I think, right now. 94. Is it 94? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so guys, uh, if you see anything you like, please go to mattsrvreviews.com, click that contact me page, yes. and somebody from our team will get back to you. I love it. All right, look at this. Very pretty. Um, little cap, little storage up here. I guess I spoke too soon. Okay, yeah, maybe um, we did. Got a you know a window here, which is nice. Beautiful solid surface countertop. Beautiful. We've got a double sink. Ooh, let's see that. Very nice. And an extension here. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so we got a oh a cap. Oh yay! Hey, that's a hundred and four dollar trash can. Uh, I think it's more like two hundred and four now. Right. <laughs> yeah, inflation. There you okay, go. Okay, so very nice. Uh, we got this for sponges, another cabinet here. Very nice. Four drawers. Wow. Okay. That's that's three actually and a half, good. Three and yeah. A half. Soft clothes. Very I nice. I did not expect that. And then uh let's see, we got the Whirlpool convection microwave. Oh man, look how big that Great is. Great size. Yes, ma'am. And then over here, okay, this mm -hmm. is strange. Yep, fold it up in the middle. There you go. Okay, so we got a three burner <clears throat> propane cooktop. Nice. Suburban. And then we've got three drawers down here, which wow, is big really drawers. a great size. Yes. And then how do you like these up uh, this backsplash? I think it's cute. Okay. And it goes well with the kitchen. Okay. Okay, so over here we have the Whirlpool uh refrigerator. Nice. Which is already getting cold. Yes, it sure and is. And let's see, is this the pantry? Mm, I don't know. Oh good. I was thinking there wasn't one, so that's great that wow. there's a pantry. In fact you're getting residential and a pantry yes. there. That that's super nice. Alright, going into the master bathroom here we have a pocket door. You know, so often when we're in this floor plan style, a whole bunch of manufacturers make that and they sacrifice on the shower space. Doesn't look like it here. Not in here, Andrea. This is a nice big shower. Plenty spacious, plenty of height, width, depth. Got the shower light right there. Really, really nice. Oh, look. Very yes. Cute. The vanity lights, max air fan. Yes. Good size medicine cabinet. Oh, man. Another, oh, that's cute. Corner storage here. And look at all the counter space they give you in the bathroom. There's a ton in the bathroom here. Okay, so we got a cabinet under here. Yes. We've got some drawers. Okay. What's this? 
Okay, that's bit, interesting. A little bit of something's better than nothing. And then one above the toilet. Well, no, oh, that's your fuse box. Okay. Okay. Very cool. We do have a Max Air yeah. fan right there. And then, Andrea, let's uh, take a little sit of roo on this new more. Porcelain. It's close. It's tight. Yeah, you look a little squished. But, Andrea, I'm not touching the wall. Okay, that's good. And it is a porcelain toilet. This is a prime poop position. Bing! Very nice. I mean, pass is pass and fail is fail. That's right. Doesn't matter if you pass by an inch or a mile. And then right here, we do got a nice little pocket door. Over here, we got a pocket door. Yes, I love the entryway here into the master bedroom. It's it's kind of wide. It is. And especially in a motorhome like this, Andrea, um, it's a small motorhome at the end of the yes. day. Uh, so that wide opening just makes it feel a lot bigger and more spacious. We do got a queen size bed on a slide out over here. Very nice with the lights all around. I like that they gave you the end, the nightstand there with electrical outlet. Yep, and a little it's bit of storage. Same on this side too. Yes, ma'am. And then let's let's see what we got up here. We've got nice storage above the bed. Right. Closing windows. Headboard, side windows. How do you like the the decor of the bed? Um, it's not my style, okay. but it goes, I guess, with it. Okay. Um, it is different in here, the valances, and I gotta say, you guys, it, it actually looks okay. I mean, it could have been a lot worse. Could have been better, could have been worse. Let's see if there's storage since we're right here. Oh! Wow, nice storage under the nice. bag. That is nice. Yes, ma'am. Okay. And then across here, Matt, we have the wardrobe. Big wardrobe. I'm telling you, these opposing slides in the bedroom just make it that much more bigger and spacious. And the fact that, you know, you can actually use the bed with the slides in is great. Yep, you got your TV right there. Okay. A little bit of countertop space there. And then we've got five drawers. Well, technically five drawers. Yes. Wow. wow. I actually like the floor in here, too. Yeah, very nice. Very nice, Andrea. I mean, it's awesome. It's nice. And it's it really is a great motorhome. Especially for couples. It's very cute. And Andrea, as great as this motorhome is and as nice as it is, it's now, before we give everybody the MSRP, it's time we tell everybody three things we like about this motorhome, three things we don't like about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Um, Let's go with three things we dislike about it. First? Yeah, and I'm gonna go okay. first. Oh wow, go ahead, I, I, go I, ahead. I gotta say you guys, um, I'm very disappointed with the outdoor storage. Talk I, to me. I don't feel like for the exterior, there is hard, a lot of storage at all. You guys seen that? Okay. I feel like maybe some of the stuff could have been taken out. Okay. And there could have been a little bit more. That's number one. Yeah. Andrea, number two, I'm going to not combo it, but I hate all the carpet up here. Yes. There. And I am going to combo that with the carpet in the storage. For what the storage does have on the outside, I'm not a fan of that. So that's number two. But then, Andrea, number three is out here. Number three, this is a beautiful high end motorhome. I really like it. The fact that the door stays open with this little clip here, I absolutely hate. I hate this. I think that's cheap. I think this is crappy. Um, when you're driving down the road, this is just gonna like- Flip flop with the wind. Like there is a place, oh, okay. but no, the wind's gonna flip flop it. I hate that. I much prefer like a friction hinge door. Okay. So that's number three. Well, Andrea, that's three things we don't like about it. Now it's time for three things we love about this motorhome. I'm gonna go first if you okay. don't mind. I love the shiny rims and the big 22.5 inch tires. Andrea, this motorhome's so small and because of how small it is, nobody's putting the 22.5s on a motorhome that's only 30 feet long. So I absolutely love that. It's gonna be a better ride, it's fancier, it's just all around nicer. And that's part of that Newmar, new more look and feel. I don't think I've seen that, so I yeah. agree, Matt. That's number one. All right, my like is, I gotta say, I love the colors in here. Beautiful. It's beautiful, it's fresh. I love this layout, so I'm gonna combo that because I, for some reason, I really like this, like with the sofa here and the TV here. Yep. I just, it just feels very, uh, I guess, homey and comfortable. For sure, that's number two. And then Andrea, number three for me, small motor home and everything i like the big shower but i like how they gave you the double slide out on here again we've seen this floor plan a lot but they won't give you the bed slide out which makes the bedroom tight as well this being so short being great for state and national parks and giving you all this space is awesome 
Wondre, do you know what time it is? It's, it's now, now time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. MSRP on this motorhome. $214,124. Andrea, MSRP. Sale price, as you guys know, it is the current 2022, so we can't advertise sale price. But Andrea, we partner with RVR, which is a nationwide network of RV dealerships. So it doesn't matter who you are, where you live, if you're interested in Newmar, all you got to do is go to mattsrvreviews.com, fill out that contact tab, we will get you with a member of our team and we will make sure that you get a great price, great service, and the best RV buying experience in the entire RV industry. Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Yes. Newmar does read the comments, so they appreciate appreciate what you guys think, so make sure you leave your feedback. Um, other than that, I hope you guys are safe and well. Thanks for watching. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching and Andrea. We'll see you next time!